certainly uh, people will need to hear this. From all the conversation, number one, basically, how do you respectfully, um, how do you respectfully state your position uh, without offending others? Although you can almost never offend people, you will always offend people. But how do you, uh, perhaps we should phrase it, how do you state your position respectfully? Uh, the offending others, that's their decision to be offended or not. Number one, from what we are saying here is, we must respect each other's view. We must respect each other's view um, uh, as long as their position is not infringing on your own human right. If your position, if my, if my position is not infringing on your uh, human right, then I must respect, you must respect my position, right? I am not coming to your house to take over your house. If I say, you know, I don't want to put on a cross or I don't want to wear a shirt, or I don't want to do that. It doesn't necessarily mean that I don't support the group, but that is just what my position is. So the respect of each other's group is super, super critical. You and I cannot coexist. You and I cannot coexist except, you know, whether it's in a, a relationship, common law, marriage, doesn't matter, workplace, equity, boss, employee. So a boss who doesn't respect the views of the employee, that employee is not going to be there for too long. It's not going to be there for too long, right?